Well, hey there, everyone. It's a sports algorithm update. Opening day of baseball and round of 16 in the college basketball March Madness tournament is also happening. We're going to talk about both of those. Before we get into that, as I will discuss in every single one of my videos, I created a cryptocurrency. It's called the Sprap Coin. This is the address if you want to search and buy any of the Sprap Coin. But even if you don't want to buy it and you just want 100 free coins, there are a lot of things you can do to get them. Um, they're actually worth something. I'm, I'm surprised I haven't gotten more requests. That just shows you that I guess the people that watch my videos are not necessarily into cryptocurrency. I wasn't either before I started paying attention to it. But I mean, one Sprout coin is worth 10 cents. I'm going to send you 100. That's, that's $10.31. And if you convert it into the SUI coin, it ends up being because the SUI coin is the coin you're going to need ten dollars and seven cents. That's real money. I mean, you could just take it and cash it out. I hope you would hold it because we're going to appreciate this coin. There are a million minted. It's tied to the sports algorithms. I've discussed a little bit about what I'm doing with that. But just understand, if you're one of the first 10 people to comment in this video, I will send you 100 scrap coins. I have too many of them right now. I have 998,000 of them. That doesn't look good. I need to have a lot less. We need to distribute more of them. So all you have to do is set up an SUI token wallet. Can be done right in Chrome. I have it built right here into Chrome. It's free to download. You're going to get a wallet address. You just send me that wallet address and I'm going to send you 100 scrap coins. It's as easy as that. We have about seven holders of this coin right now. We need to have a lot more than that. So that's my little ad at the beginning of this is, is uh, get a piece of my Sprout coin. Other ways you can get Sprout coins are by picking a team against the algorithm. You will win 100 Sprout coins from me if you pick a team that is on the losing side of the list, according to the algorithm, but they win. So let's talk about the games that are going on tonight and tomorrow in college basketball, and then we'll get to baseball. Tonight's games, there are four of them. Of course, the odds makers and the algorithm almost in complete alignment. All of these teams are favorites. Arizona, Connecticut, Iowa State, North Carolina. And then tomorrow's games being tomorrow's games, Friday being Marquette, Houston, Purdue, and Tennessee. One thing to note here is that Duke has a game time decision, a big player who's a game time decision injury wise, which is why they're down at 80% health. Uh, it's some guy with a finger injury, so he'll probably play. Your fingers, you know, it, it does affect your shooting, but he's probably going to play. Let's see who it is. There's also somebody who's out for the season on Duke as well. There's uh, Christian Reeves and Caleb Foster out for the season, but the big one is Jeremy Roach, finger injury. He plays. That's a huge impact because he is one of the best players. Looks like one of the top two players on the team for Duke. So, just another thing that's really putting this in favor of Houston, even though, of course, I personally like Duke in that game. So, you know, Houston's winning. Um, anyway, these games, like I said, all are coming in as favorites. Notice that Arizona's line is not nearly as bad as Connecticut's line. So really, people think that that Connecticut is going to win this game over San Diego State. That's why they're minus 800. Arizona's only minus 295, and they're at the top of this list. So if you had to pick one of those two teams, you'd go with Arizona. Marquette over NC State. NC State was a lower seed. That's not too much of a surprise. Here's Houston at that minus 190 against potentially injured Duke. Then you've got Purdue over Gonzaga. Zach Eady over Gonzaga. That should be a very good game. Notice Purdue's strength of schedule was really, really a huge tip in their favor. They play a lot of good teams throughout the year. Then here you have Iowa State beating Illinois, and that's only minus 109. We're getting down to some closer margin games here. But that is what it picks. And look at how close this Tennessee Creighton game is supposed to be. And the North Carolina against Alabama, there are some injuries on Alabama, which would probably put that in favor of North Carolina. But notice out of these three teams at the bottom, you get the best line out of Iowa State, and they're, they're at the top of that list at the bottom here. So that's kind of what it says. If you would like to pick one of these teams, be the first to comment in the video, you pick one of these teams. And if you win, I send you 100 Sprout Coins. Just go set up an SUI wallet. 
So that is college basketball for Sweet 16. Now let's go in and discuss baseball. When it comes to baseball, we have opening day today. And I believe there's one game going on right now. Baltimore Orioles score. Currently, the Orioles are leading the Angels 5-1 to one in look, the top of the fourth. Look at that. Fourth inning. I know it's early, but they're already up 5-1. to one. They can't get to the port because there's no bridge, but they apparently can be up in this game 5-1. to one. So the baseball algorithm at least starting off strong so far here. Uh, other picks that are of interest, I did a video about this yesterday. There is not too much new to uh, discuss. Did have Cleveland up here as the number one pick. That is the pick that I'm tying to adding liquidity to the Sprap coin. If Cleveland wins today, I add uh, whatever $100 pays. I think it's going to be about $70. Bucks. Um, if they win, I'll add that to the Sprap liquidity pool. Yet another reason to to get in here and get some Sprap coins because it's just going to keep going up. You have my promise. I'm just adding liquidity and sending coins out. I'm not selling any of them. We're in it for the long haul. Uh, so get in on that. Anything else of interest in here? You get this one underdog down here. A lot of these games are closer. Houston over the Yankees. Oh, yeah. Two people that have made picks already. Joan picked San Diego over San Francisco. So that one's taken. And somebody else picked the Yankees plus one and a half. I let them take the Yankees plus one and a half for some reason. Um, so those two are taken. But if you'd like to take any other of these games and potentially win 100 Sprout Coin from me, those are the ones that are still available. So we'll do a review of the results and we'll run the macro later tonight to determine what the best percentage weights were uh, that, that yielded the best results. But hopefully we have a good day here on opening day and it should be fun. And really, for those of you who are definitely interested in, in college basketball, this is the time for all the March Madness brackets when uh, we really get down deep to, to kind of get an idea who's going to win your tournaments these games here. You know, a lot of these teams were heavily favored teams. It just kind of shows you that, I mean, the algorithm and the odds makers were, I believe, in complete alignment this year once the uh, the full bracket of 64 teams was set up. I don't think that has ever happened. Just goes to show you how this has become the standard in the industry for predicting games. And this year, it, it's pretty much come to fruition. I think the algorithm had, uh, of the 16 teams, I believe it had 12 of these teams making it to this route, at least 12, maybe even 13. When I, let's go back and look at that video. Uh, so, you know, you're doing pretty good if you follow the algorithm's advice this year so far. All right, that's the update. There'll be more. I will continue to say, sign up for an SUI wallet. You can get Sprout Coins from me. They're worth something now, and they're going to be continuing to go up as I add liquidity. And hopefully the SUI token, which it is tied to, also goes up. I think it's at about $2 uh, a token right now, and that yields a $0.10 cent per token Sprout value. So this, I mean, this is, it's crypto money, but it's also real money. I mean, you can convert this into cash relatively quickly through any of the exchanges. So it's just, I'm just fascinated with how all this works, because as we build this, um, it's just going to be people that support the algorithms and, and support what I'm doing here. We're going to have a, a wide variety of people that hold this token and, you know, tell your friends because I'm giving them away and I've got a lot to give away. And even giving them away has the effect of essentially raising the value because there are more people holding it and potentially trading it. All right, there you go. That's the update for the day. I would say college basketball pick of the day. I mean, it's got to be Arizona because it's on top, but they're minus 295. But really, the Iowa State at minus 109 is the best line. So we'll see if the algorithm picks this one off and Ohio, uh, Iowa State wins this game. All right, good luck, everybody. Enjoy your Thursday of sports, and may all your picks be winning.